Well, hello there, and welcome back to the Confederation of Island States, that is the Rhodesian Empire, on Imperium Selectum 6.5. We have had, after a bit of a slow start, where we bought up mm, territory. Ooh. Are we at war with these? No, but it looks like we're going to lose that one. We have um, acquired Samnos, Kos, Thera, Eulis, and we've started the conquest of the large and profitable island of Crete. We um, apparently have got a ceasefire with these green Cretan factions. They've got two stacks, we've only got the one, so that's a bit of a worry. Um, and we're also at war with um, Lyktos. No, Lytos. Lycos is the um, is the is the town or the territory. We just lost some money. Thanos has built some sewers. So let's get all the things. It was gonna ducks in a row first. Double Poseidon. Oh, we got a little baby. Thymotes. Thymotes. And the spy didn't go somewhere. We'll sort that out in a second. Um, you're building, you're building, you're not building. We could have one of them. We make five grand a go. Most of our money is coming via conquest. I mean, we've got another one to go. We've got to go take Acades now. And then we will be sort of in amongst the, the blues. We can then start actually thinking about one, two. Do they have this one as well? What do we, what's this? No, so they've got two um, territories to go. It's quite knackered. This army does need to be returned for retraining, actually. Where is the closest place we can build or recruit Rhodesian, not them. I think he has to go back to Rhodes. Yes, so we're going to need, we could do with the be peace quick. with these chaps. Our patience is limited. Surely you jest. I'm not sure. Oh, we'll do it after the, the battle. We're going to take on Captain Tibius. He comes with some Peltas, some Cretan Hoplites, and some Theroporoi. Our army is vastly larger than his. So this will be a win. It'll be a simple march in and walk to the, walk to the town centre. And another one will have fallen to the might of Rhodes. Slight problem. Oh, I wonder if I move that. Just before I started recording, there was a hoplite on the ship just the south of Crete. I wonder if that hoplite was meant to be merged with the hoplites already in the army. Maybe that was why, to stop them having hundreds of units. We'll live to see that day. Units. Drop Units. the ram. So, let's try not to get some people killed off. You're brand new, so you could do with some experience as well. Oh, they're just so knackered. Infantry. Then we got nine now, so it's a nice simple three by three split. Cavalry will most likely be useless. Uh, it's only a little wall, so I reckon if we just move ourselves forward a little bit, we'll have complete coverage. 
missile coverage of the main front street. Just to pepper them with our Rhodesian, with our mighty Rhodesian slingers. This army does need to be retrained. The problem we've got, of course, is the minute that it leaves Crete, there's a good chance that we're going to lose a fair few of our Cretan holdings. Which is a bit of a shame, really. They had three units. Why can't I only see two? Oh, there's one here. There's two here. We'll zoom in on the map. There's one there. There's another one there. Grecian hoplites. We want to surround those because they slogging our way through a, a city or a town our battle map is just excruciating. Our soldiers are at the walls. Now uh, they must batter our way through. Oh, are our slingers gonna? Are they in range? Are you gonna come towards the gate? We haven't built anything other than normal standard Rhodesian hoplites. Oh, these ones are coming. That's good news. The enemy gate is down. Our battering ram has done its work. Good stuff. The walls are breached, and the way into the city is open for our soldiers. Got one more to Order go. Attack. Don't forget the Rhodesian slingers. The actual bullets are armor-piercing. They are mighty, and they are effective. 108. They have 200. Look at just look at the number of dead. Sixty-three of them left. We have absolutely creamed that unit, and it's going to run back as well. Good work. Will we get rid of the whole unit? Will any of them make it out alive? There's two of them to go. When we fire, there's a thousand lead pellets. Good work. Right, we're trying to keep some certain units alive. So we could pop you in there. Infantry! Infantry. Our soldiers have captured the walls. Now is the time to press on and capture this place. We want you to go down this street here. Where's the... Um, it's going to be this one. Infantry. Just walk. Infantry. 146 and 111. 146 is the next one. Just pop them all in the street. See if we can just wear them down. We don't want you on skirmish, that's a good idea. Alright. 
289 is the biggest one. shall be coming your way. Now that doesn't seem like that was what we wanted them to do there. What's going on? Yeah, they're all stood on top of each other so it's not really that effective. Um, Halt. main bad guy, this is the, it's not our main enemy, it's the Greek city-states who you can't play as, they're like, oh my word, just get into them, 97, two of them on red now, right, we need to get this chap over there, these two, get behind them, stop them, I'm throwing those damn javelins. Oh, I want someone just to stay behind. Keep the counter going. 72. There we are. They're wavering. Two chevrons. None of my units have any experience yet. Bit of a shame that we're, we've only just started conquering parts of the world. Our first port of call was just to buy up territory from Egypt, really. I don't think we bought it off anyone else, but now we're no longer, because we went to war, we're no longer allied with the Egyptians. have gone on a charge from around the corner as well. Nice. Good work. These have got to be nearly done. 115 damage. They've lost 60% nearly. I always get that wrong. That takes a while. Because it says 93%, I, that makes me think We've lost 93% of the army, and it's not. We've, lo we've still got 93% of the army remaining. Go on, stab him with your pointy stick, sir. Oh, I just saw some... It's facing on the wrong side of his head. 
bit of a glitch there, but it's still a damn fine game. Right, they're going. Kill them all. Don't let them escape and reform. Let's go, let's go, let's go. 54, 40. Oh, we're just slaughtering them. 30. Watch them fall before the mighty Rhodesian Empire. Charge! Two units that are knackered come into the center. There's everyone but you two. There are 164 of these. Just pile in, they're all stuck against the wall. That charge has taken out maybe 30. I've got a lovely little owl. That always is, that's meant to be Athens, isn't it? The owl of wisdom. Oh, they're reloading. They're trying to throw their javelins, but I'm not sure it's a useful tactic at this point because they're trapped. camera shot that I use an awful lot. Oh, we split them in two. There's a lump of them there. There's a lump of them here as well. I use this a lot in Empire 2. If you're interested in Empire 2, feel free. There's a Russian campaign going on in the minute. It's going rather well. I say rather well. We haven't, we haven't lost Moscow by that point. By that statement. 93 of them. Not too many units on orange and two on red. This army needs to be retrained. We're going to maybe if we gave this to the oh, chill out, mate. Chill out. What are you doing? Maybe if we could give this to the blue faction and get a bit of a peace while we go and retrain our army. Our cavalry's knackered as well. Everything's knackered, and we've only got the one army, so we've got to do some shenanigans. Like I said, the minute we take it off Crete, it's going to be the, the minute that Litos come and try and take some of our territory back. It depends how quick we can be with it. Well, he just killed my... No, he didn't. Look, he's up again. Now he's poking away single combat. Oh, he got knocked. Oh, both of them got back up again. Oh, he's looking the wrong way now. I say, most of our units do have a silver armor. There we are. This is a heroic victory. We lost 448. There's no tidy way of doing the, the city siege on this. It is brutal. It's a shame you don't have people lobbing bricks and tiles and things out of the street, out of the house as well. That's how. Oh, what's his name? Pyrrhus of Epirus died. He got hit by a brick thrown by an old woman, didn't he? The siege. I, I want to say Sparta, but I think I might be wrong. I think it's sort of it's in that region of the world. Um, we could, yeah, we'll do that. We get some slaves to go. Now I don't know if I can keep that. Let's have a look. Do 
doesn't look like I can. Yes, my lord. I shall be quick. Our patience is limited. There's no point giving it to them. But we do need more. And the profits have gone up to nearly eight grand, so we'll just put a crappy garrison unit in. Have we got one of them? There we go. 184, that's the best one. They've got their own religion, that's not that's yes, not helpful. Yes, Alright, we need to get yes, he's the he's our king or our leader at least. The first Rhodesian among many. Yes, We've only got the one ship, so he has to go port hopping. Ah good. Taking all those slaves has made a you upgrade. We're going to have to stop building for a second, just so we can get our the funds together for our army to retrain. Oh, Syracuse is doing quite well. We've got two spies sort of trying to fill in as much of the map as we can, because we don't really get... It's, it's such a large map, we can't really pinpoint on that map where we are. They've got two stacks in Syracuse. In my Syracuse campaign, as soon as, you as soon as I defeated the army with the elephants in, a full stack. I think it was in Selenius or where the crabs are, a Kragus. The island was one, but that was not playing it on extreme mode. I would recommend that you do play it on extreme mode. There seems to be a lot more fighting in this version. Which is, let's face it, it's the point of the game, isn't it? So. Could you were finding um, a Greek city state to see. Oh, well, I need to find out if there's another Greek city state on. Yeah, we know about this. Question is, we are surrounded. can we get back in time with a fully re retrained and re equipped army? What's occurring over here? That's Macedon trying to do something with that purple looking army. Doesn't look very full. Let me slowly zoom in on it. What? I can't go any further. Would you like to trade with me? We've got trade. Would you consider? 90. I was thinking something more in line with a thousand. Would you consider? And no, you're just being time. difficult, really, aren't you? So you've had a look at Sicily, we can now just leave. Seems like our fellow Greeks are doing rather well, look at that. Awaiting your command. Yes, my lord. Oh no, they haven't. I was just about to say, I look, those colours to me look like Sicily had managed to get a foothold on mainland Italy. But no. That would be a turn up for the books. We've got Mr. Spy over here in Iberia. Let's just see if we can fill some of this in. I should zoom in the map to see what I actually can see. Not, not possible. Not sir. possible. Moving. Alpha moves, side. So I'll try and walk up through the interior. 
And these are, this is Cyrene, which seem to have expanded quite a long way in this game. Oh, there's Carthage. So they haven't gone silly amounts, but they have gone, a, if you were Carthage, you'd be curious about the plans. We made a 32 coin profit. Boom. We're now an empire size three. We're now a regional power. I don't know, no, we're an empire size four, 11 to 20 cities. We'll have to come back for that one. Let's go back to the island. We could do with you being able to get, you can't get there. Yes, sir. Send it to that dock. Right, we are retraining, so if we get all of you. Oh, hang on, I've not thought I've not thought this through. We have to get you two out. Ready to sail. Off the boat. Oh, there we go. Right, let's retrain some stuff. Seventy-eight and seventy. Ninety-five, ninety-nine. I'd like the full complement of cavalry, and then we'll, that'll just have to do. We'll come straight back. We're probably going to. Are they? Mm, they equip themselves to come in, I think. I think so. We can't hold it with a unit of archers. Your Honor, Would I you like an alliance? No. Is this all Kydonia? Yeah, so the Greek city states are now off Crete. So we just got to get to a point where we can return. Wow, repairing that army has cost us four grand to go. We, have, we were making 8,000 profit, now we're back down to four. That's a lot of hoplites. And we didn't even retrain them all, actually. But that'll do. As soon as it re, um, disembarks on... Re-disembarks, is that... As soon as it lands on Crete again, <laughs> then we'll be able to put the, once, uh, the retraining. I think we have fought a couple of land um, sort of pitched battles rather than sieges, but it is the sieges that actually take their toll on the army. We did manage to, to retrain all of the units as well, which is a bit of a shame, but I don't want to spend another turn. That is what... Um, waiting to see if they'll take my towns off me. We've got to be quick and swift and decisive, although that is a problem. That is two full stacks, basically, with a couple of units missing, sitting on an island which we do not care about. Oh, so we're going to have some land battles. We are surrounded! Mm. We're going to have to be quick. That's why we can't stay and retrain the army. There's something about roads that, uh, when you think about it, they should not have been a famous city-state. I know they were famous at the time when everybody was small. 200, 200, yeah, we'll just have to go with it. Soz. Good Greeks are dying. Name that Greek. Ajax. I'll let you off. Oh, okay. Here we go. Disembark. We got a full. We haven't even got a full stack yet. Ready. Ah.
someone's died. Oh, these all have silver. Well, that's quite cool. Ships ready. Oh, is that the experiment? I think that is where we kept the Cretian temple. I don't know if we can expand on them, though. That's the problem. If we can get gold armor out of them. That'd be lovely. Uh, Agathocles the Fat. I don't think we'll lose this one. I think they might attack this one here. Although, on this version of the game, I mean, be, being Rome remastered more than Imperium Resurrection, the AI seems to react more just to your army being in the vicinity of their army. So just by me being there, they might choose to not go through with it. Do not have another diplomat. Can we not be allied with you now? I shall speak with them at once. We see no benefit to us. You bastards. What are my victory conditions in this? I think I'm playing... Does it tell me my victory conditions? Hmm. I don't know where things are on this one. Oh, what's a trade in bargain? Can I do that? I don't know. I don't know. Back we go to Spain. Let's move Mr. Spy. Let's find out as many settlements as possible before he goes roaming around in Gaul. Moving into position. At your service. Moving into position. Right, let's see if we lose some of our settlements. I think the blues will crap themselves at the sight of a full Rhodesian army landing near them and will regroup. So Q losing both settlements to auto resolve. Because there's only a, there's only a, a unit of archers in there. I can't do anything about it. What we want to do is we want to face them in the field. Where our Rhodesian slingers can actually empty all of their slingshots on them. That's what the key is. Whereas when we get to the settlements, we just we can I mean we we absolutely creamed that one unit that walked in front of the gate, didn't we? But we can't do that because we can't deploy them with any great effectiveness, effect, effectivity. Do write in and tell me what that word should have been. I can't, I don't know. It's very early in the morning. That might explain why my voice is slightly different. And also, I've got a real problem with my nose. I don't know what's wrong with it. But... but for some reason, I think my cat has decided to attack my face and I, I've got a scratch. If I touch it, I sneeze. It's a bizarre thing to have. It's in the... Oh, you... Greetings. Oh. Our thanks. Oh, I thought... I thought the, um... Egyptians were going to attack us. Yeah, we knew knew about that. Can't do anything. There's 2,000 of them there. Have they genuinely left that city undefended? Okay, we don't want war with Egypt because they've still got the garrisons on the islands that we bought off them that used to be in the towns. Like you can see there with Samnos, there's still like a couple of units and a general stood outside. We need them all 
they never came to sort of group them and get rid of them. It was a weird decision yes, on their part, I thought. Yes, my lord. Up goes Mr. Diplomat. Yes, my lord. At once. I can I cannot do that, sir. At once. Here's Mr. Spy. Moving. Moving into position. We filled in quite a lot of the map with just these two spies running My about. When you get to a point where there's endless cities on the coast in Carthage, here we go. You start seeing civilization coming up. Ah, oh, we're going back to being a minor power. Because we lost to Cadiz, that's disappointing. Um, just delete them all. Yes, my right, let's move you there. Have they actually done what I think they've done? No, what's in it? That looks like... Oh, it's the Factionaire in Knossos. That's a captain. That's the Faction Leader. That's just their family friend. Now, what we could do is we take the bulk of their forces and invest the settlement with no interest in going into the town. We're going to starve them out. They're going to have to bring this force to come and help lift the siege, and we'll be forcing them into an actual pitched battle. That's my plan. Oh, we got another one of them. Ready to sail! Yes, Captain! Sir! Yes, sir! Because we only have the one ship, we can never end a go at sea, because they'll just sink it. Because they're bastards. We're going to need to put some genuine effort into building up our navy soon. Alright, how long until we got this? Five turns. So we'll do an extra turn. Is there anything we can build here? I don't mind that. So this hoplite is going to go and complete that stack. There's a massive fish on top of that mountain at the bottom of the screen. And we're going to just hope that they desperate that they group all of their forces together and we can, we're on a hill or an elevated position. I don't know how big that hill is actually, but we can then use our glorious Rhodesian slingers and our mighty hoplites to hold the line. We've got all of our cavalry retrained, even though they always die no matter what we do with them because they're not very good. But it would allow us to defeat all of their forces in one go. We're going for the big win now against that one faction. Who's that? Feels very much like the um, green Cretian faction. 
has emptied all of its forces out of Crete onto the island which I own by mainland Greece. And they're not do they don't know what to do now because we're we're not at war. And it's poor planning on their part. Ready. Leaving the army off their boat. So if you fit into there. Got a full complement, that's pretty damn Ready. good. into the port so we don't have to replace you you're on low need to increase your population don't we Zeus and Artemis what why don't we have another Get some sewers up. Can I be of service? What is Is there supplies on this? Well supplied. Oh, I don't know how long that's gonna last for. Hmm. So this is the mountain that we want to make our stand on. I'm still, I still think it's a clever plan. I'm going to go with it. It's a risky strategy, but hopefully, if they don't come, we'll just, we'll, we'll just want them. They won't be, they won't be able to. They need to bring these last four, couple of forces. They might actually build up some forces. That might be the problem that we're about to, we're about to face. But that will be next episode. We have taken one and lost it and then we're back on the island so it's a bit of a slog at the minute once we've got crete under well or at least half of crete and we can hopefully coexist with the greens for a little bit kydonia yeah then we shall be in a good position remember we actually only started with three territories and we now have three four five six seven eight nine 10 so we're doing okay but we'll leave it there for now so thank you very much for watching if indeed you have do take care of yourselves and goodbye for now